Total War Warhammer 3 is the best strategy game of 2022, but it's also a divisive one. Creative Assembly tipped over the traditional Total War campaign structure, replacing it with an experimental race, with the game's major factions rushing to claim the power of an imprisoned bear god. With less of a sandbox structure and frequent trips into the various realms of chaos, it plays like no other Total War. That's a strength, but one with diminishing returns. Impeccable faction design made repeat trips worthwhile, however. Warhammer 3 boasts some of the most unusual and compelling factions in any strategy game, the pinnacle of which is Chaos Undivided, a faction led by a fully customizable demon prince, the first of its kind in Total War, and a progression system that effectively gives you multiple factions in one dangerous package. What players really wanted, though, was a new sandbox. With Immortal Empires, Creative Assembly came through. This free DLC is available to everyone who owns the full trilogy, and squashes all three games into one mega campaign. 278 factions, 86 playable legendary lords. It's the biggest strategy game I've ever played. Every playstyle feels like it's been catered for. You can lead dark elf pirates as they loot their way through Cathay, able to recruit a new, ultra-powerful Black Ark, essentially a mobile base, for every major port they conquer. Or a seductive demonic host, seducing mortal factions and turning them into your vassals. Every single part of this gargantuan map has an interesting conflict raging, with delightfully weird matchups. Who doesn't want to watch dinosaurs and demons beat the snot out of each other? Factions you may have been playing for years have been given a new lease on life, with new challenges, quests, and mechanics. Features like diplomacy and the economy, meanwhile, which Total War has often struggled with, are now effective tools that genuinely feel fun to play around with. So many of the criticisms I've held onto for years have been washed away. Even though Immortal Empires is still in beta, it's already the best that Total War has ever been, making Total War Warhammer 3 an essential addition to your strategy library.